From the perspective of appearance, Hongqi HS7 has a unique aura, giving people a majestic and cheerful feeling. The large area flat waterfall front grille does not look too boring. There are a total of 10 silver decorative strips decorated inside. In the middle there is a flattened red three-dimensional logo. Under the grille, the air intake is tightly connected to it and a silver front lip is provided. The headlight set is split, the daytime running lights have a multi-point design. High and low beam headlights are placed in the directional groove. Both provide LED light sources. Functionally, there are adaptive high and low beams and automatic headlights respectively. The space of Hongqi HS7 is not small. According to specific data, the length, width, and height are 4,995 by 1,960 by 1,760 mm, and the body wheelbase is 2,920 mm. A three-section waist design is adopted on the side, focusing on muscle feeling, and there are 20-inch pedal-style wheels at the bottom. The vehicle, which is the top version of the model, has multi-layer soundproof glass throughout, and privacy glass is added to the rear row, providing good performance in business and home use. The rear looks younger, with a total of four exhaust outlets on each side at the bottom. The upper taillights have an exaggerated, crossover-type design, and the light strips on both sides resemble a pair of wings. Entering the Hongqi HS7 car, the central control area adopts the spread wing design, which looks more advanced. The size of the central control screen in a vertical layout is 12.6 inches. The vehicle supports OTA upgrades and Internet of Vehicles functions. Going forward, it is equipped with a streaming rearview mirror. Under the central control screen, a wireless charging area with 40W charging power is offered. Looking at the main driving position, the steering wheel is covered in leather, the handlebar has a perforated design, and the full LCD instrument screen is 12.3 inches in size. Additionally, the vehicle is equipped with Dynaudio audio system with 12 speakers throughout the vehicle. The layout of the six-seater model is undoubtedly 2 plus 2 plus 2, with individual seats in the middle row and a small table that can be used for eating or working. The front seats provide electric adjustment and the seat material is a combination of genuine leather plus artificial leather. The main driver provides heating, ventilation, and memory functions. Both the front and rear seats have aviation headrests, and the backrest angle is adjustable. In terms of specific space, I am 1.8 meters tall. Sitting in the last row, my legs are still very wide, and there is basically nothing how much feeling of pressure, and the panoramic sunroof is also very friendly to the back row it's lively and the lighting is not bad. Finally, the 2.0T turbocharged engine is quite powerful, with 185 kilowatts maximum power and 380nm maximum torque. In terms of driving style, the starting point is generally soft and stable. After all, it is not a very radical sports SUV, but in the middle and advanced stages the power reserve is quite strong and overtaking can be completed quickly. Acceleration from 0 to 100 km is 8.8 .8 seconds.